as spring arrives, our woodlands burst into life. One of the most iconic flowers signifying new growth is blossom. It attracts the first emerging bumblebees. With nectar sources few and far between in early spring, they make the most of the bountiful blossom. Emerging as early as February, these queen bees are gathering energy in order to start a colony, with the nest found deep underground in old rodent burrows. Down on the ground, a suspicious looking doppelganger is at work, the bee fly. Bee flies are bee lookalikes, but flies by nature. They disguise themselves in order to get close to entrances of solitary bee and solitary wasp burrows, flicking their eggs into the nest which will hatch and eat the bee or wasp larva. This bee fly, however, is busy feasting on one of its favourite food plants, wild primroses. Using its long straight proboscis to feast on the nectar within. Distinguishing a bee fly from a bee is easy enough by looking at the wing shape. However, if you can't get that close, note their flight style and long back legs which dangle beneath them. In the warmer weather, butterflies are also on the wing like this peacock butterfly. Newly emerged, they need to bask in the sunlight and warm up their bodies, before pairing up in beautiful courtship flights which can be seen throughout our woodlands. If you look closely at the ground, you may find all sorts of small holes and if nearby, you also find droppings, an impressive beetle may be around. The Minotaur Beetle. This male is sporting spectacular horns, which it uses to defend its nest. This stunning beetle searches the forest floor for rabbit droppings, its favourite food. Once he's had his fill, he will drag the dung back to his nest for his larvae to feed on. As the sun begins to set, there is one insect that emerges in huge numbers, the gnat. Much maligned, these tiny insects actually put on a stunning display if you look closely. Swarming together, they form beautiful ghost-like clouds which twinkle in the late evening sun, marking the end to another day in our woodlands. <laughs>